everything's the name. Can't do change in the game. Doing my thing in my own lane. Every time you see me, I'm hitting them switches. Sliding through with something super vicious. Who is this? Mr. Everything's the name. Can't do change in the game. Doing my thing in my own lane. Every time you see me, I'm hitting them switches. Sliding through with something super vicious. Who is this? What's going on, everybody? This is Mr. Everything, and I'm back with another video bringing y'all low riders and horsepower. You dig? Rain, sleet, hell, snow, or shine, nothing, and no one stops the grind. Not even the haters on the sidelines. Now, go ahead and hit that like button. You know what I'm saying? Subscribe to the channel if you haven't already. But if you have, thank you very kindly. You know, I'm uh, I'm just gonna shoot straight with y'all today. I always shoot straight anyway, but I'm just gonna get right into it. Now, I've been working on this truck for a while. You know what I mean? Longer than an hour or so trying to adjust the chains. Now, I ain't going to tell y'all how this really ended up. Now, see, this is a totally different video because I was, the video that I originally shot scrapped it. About 15 minutes, and I was doing stuff all wrong. So, got some good advice from Speed, you know what I'm saying? So, uh, he schooled me on what, what I was doing wrong somewhat. So, you're only going to get probably a small video today because in the midst of me trying to adjust everything that I was doing um trying to get the chains on here so I could do three wheel again so in the midst of me trying to take off chains adjust chains and everything like that the batteries is running low so I'm gonna have to charge them up and show y'all everything once I got it complete but I can show y'all what I got so far I done hooked the chains everything up and uh it's going to be just like that. Just check out what I got. All right. Now, I got everything right here. Um, this is one of the old bolts. I've had it forever. So, it's kind of rusty, but still does the same thing. I did get a brand new bolt. You can see it in there. Same size and everything. Just in case, you know, you never know if you're going to snap anything or not. And then got the chain. It's three feet worth of chain. 14 inch cylinders. It should be enough. I'm not perfect on it. So this is really, you know, a lot of this stuff, I'm not perfect with it. Adjustable wrench. I mean, I got sockets that'll fit these size uh, nuts and bolts and everything. But it ain't going to, uh, it's not going to hurt nothing just to use an adjustable. And these is for the, uh, the screws to go up top on the bridge. Uh, that the chain is going to hook to. So I got everything ready to go. Will I need more chain or not? I shouldn't. What if I do this stuff is actually cheap? Um, I mean, literally, bolts that don't even cost a dollar with, with a nut that goes on the end and washers and the chains, I mean, literally only a few dollars uh, per foot. So, I mean, this. This should do the trick. And I did have thinner chains. When I first got this, whatever this looks like to you on camera, because stuff never does it justice on camera. But whatever this, these links look like to you, these are pretty nice size links. The ones that they originally came with were pretty thin. So these should be more than good enough uh, for me to work with. So we're about to get to it. So, right there, you can see, that's where the bolt goes in. Uh, for the bottom chain down there, look at the other side, there's already a bolt in there, because I always keep one, just in case, so that's where we're going to start. Alright, so, I'm going to try to show you as good as I can. So, we've got the screw in there, not on this side, so you will want to 
have uh, one socket on one side and like your adjustable or another socket or open in the wrench on the other side because you want to be able to tighten it down. Now I ain't got it as tight as it can go right now because I'm just getting everything in place. So we got the chain. I got it extended, the cylinder up right now. Uh, so I need to go ahead and pull up the chain and see how far it goes till it gets to the spot where I want it to be. All right now, got both chains, sets of chains hooked up. Try to see as far as I can go up there. Got both chains hooked up. So now all I gotta do is basically do a bunch of adjusting and uh, once I do the adjustments we'll be able to go ahead and three wheel all right so that's all I got uh, could have had a whole lot more but like I say that video would have been a straight up blooper because uh, I was doing it all wrong so I'm just letting y'all uh, know where I'm at basically just upload today so I still keep in the loop with everybody because I try to upload at least once a week sometime twice so I'm just letting y'all know what I got. And so nobody's uh, going to have fun laughing at this one because I scrapped that old video that was jacked up. You know what I mean? So I uh, hope y'all enjoyed this little bit of a video. Until next time, rain, sleet, hell, snow, or shine, nothing and no one stops the grind. Not even haters on the sidelines. I am Mr. Everything, bringing y'all lowriders and horsepower. Until next time, I'm out.